hello youtube and welcome to another windows tutorial so in this video we will continue our series of enumerating windows active directory using a tool called windup search so are you ready let's get started so as you have seen on my previous videos i show you some couple of tools to use in order to enumerate windows active directory We've seen PowerShell, of course, and PowerView and other tool. But here we're going to see another tool called WindUp Search. So simply you go to your browser and you type window WindUp Search actually, okay? So here we go. So you get this uh, GitHub repo. So the name of the repo is Ropnop, okay? And this is actually a Python script. So here you can see a little description of this tool. So WindUp Search is Python script to help you enumerate users group computers for Windows domain through LDAP queries. So actually, as you may know, LDAP is a protocol used in order to query Windows Active Directory using the TCP port 389 as you can see here, okay? So we're gonna install this uh, tool and uh, show you a couple of uh, commands that you can use in order to enumerate actually Windows Active Directory, okay? So first thing first, we have to ensure that we have a special Python LDAP model installed. So, so before we begin, actually we have to install a Python LDAP model, okay? So for that we'll be using pip to make sure it's installed. So this is the command you will use in order to install the Python model LDAP. Here we go. So here as you can see the requirement already satisfied, okay? So we have already installed Python LDAP, okay? So now that uh, the Python LDAP is installed, we can uh, start cloning the GitHub repo for the WinDAP search. So I will use the git clone, okay? HTTPS here, I will give actually the path to the GitHub repo for WinDAP search. So this is github.com, okay, slash. And the name of the repo is uh, Ropnop. And of course, the name of our window wind up actually search. That get of course in order to clone the repo. Okay. So let's clone it. Here we go. So as you can see, it was very fast. So now, in order to run actually uh, this uh, wind up search, we have to go to the wind up so here you have seen that a directory called wind up search has been created so let's go inside it here we go and now we can see all the files that exist here and here you can see that there is a file or python script wind up search that we'll be using actually okay so let's use it py with the minus h for help okay so here we go so you can see here a lot of arguments for uh, actually this wind up search okay but here I'll stop with something very basic so in order for example to uh, enumerate users we'll be using the same command but here I will provide, of course, the first thing is the domain controller IP address. So DC IP. So actually it's dash dash DC IP. And here I will provide the IP address of my domain controller, which is in my case that one that one. Okay. Then I have to provide user. So remember, this tool is post-exploitation tool, which means that you must already has 
actually some credentials for your domain controller okay it's also used for cracking or reverse engineering uh, windows active directory here but here we are using it just for enumerating windows active directory so let's provide user name for example administrator at and here i will provide my domain which is in this case aminos.local okay and of course also i have to provide password which is password here we go so this is the password for the administrator of the domain controller and for enumerating users we use the switches dash users simple as that so this command will enumerate all users in my aminos.local domain so let's execute it and see what we get so here of course you have a lot of uh, users so here it has found 11 so of course the common name administrator we have a guest we have amino we have radius users yasina jenny we have sshd so and of course here we have some salesperson one salesperson two and so on okay so as you have seen it was pretty easy to actually enumerate users so this is the command to enumerate users we could of course there is an abbreviation for this uh, dash dash users you can just use dash capital u for users and we'll get actually the same result okay so let's now enumerate uh, for example groups okay so simply you have to replace users by groups in order to enumerate all the groups in the aminos.local active domain active directory domain here we go so of course by default every domain controller have a lot of uh, built-in groups so we have domain admins we have ras and isa servers as you can see here we have domain guests we have group policy creators owners so here you can see all the groups that actually belong to this domain okay and of course you can replace these groups by the capital G and providing just one dash and you will get the same result okay so here actually in my domain i have a group let's say that you want to see the member the group membership so for example let me run this command here minus m for the group for example administrator okay administrators just to see the group membership for this group here so here it has found nothing because it hasn't found administrator here I I make a mistake I need an I here administrators here we go so you can see here it has found four members okay so of course aminos there is amino there is administrator there is enterprise admin and domain admins okay so let's see if we have for example uh, cells so here it asks me which DN do you want to use so let's use this third one for example here it has found zero but here you can see all the members of this uh, cells actually it's organizational unit so we can verify that if we go to our windows server here so let me log on 
with my password and if I go to users and computers you can see here that they have an organizational unit called cells which contains actually three members okay so just for verification we can of course also enumerate the uh, domain admins we'll be using switches that dash domain admins DA so you can see that I only have one which is administrator here okay let's enumerate computers so we'll use the same button here for computers so here it has found a lot of computers we have Windows 7 user PC desktop Win 10 and Win 7 so these are all the computers that belong to this domain actually it has found five computers okay and finally you can even search for a specific thing inside this uh, Windows domain using switch minus s for search and here you provide the word that you want to search for so I know for example there is a user called Jenny so let's search for it and here we go it has found it common name it's Jenny it's under organizational unit users and of course it belongs to the domain aminos local okay so as you can see it's pretty nice tool that you can use in your everyday actually task in order to enumerate windows active directory so that was just a brief introduction to this uh, python script called windup search in order to enumerate windows active directory as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye